Hi guys, welcome back to another video. This is the first episode of what I am calling season two. Thank you very much to all the subscribers and all the support over the last year. I read your comments, every single one, and I enjoy reading your feedback. A lot of it was positive, but some of it was negative, especially the background music. Some of you found it too loud. Duly noted, the first video I'm making for season two is an apology for season one. In an episode comparing the B-58 and the B-58TU, I said that there were four variants. I said that there was the B-58B-30 M0, the B-58B-30 M1, and the B-58B-30 O1. I also said that the Supra, or the 2019 Supra, had a unique variant of the engine, the B-58B-30C. But I was wrong. You see, there are not four variants, there are three variants, and only three variants. The B58B30 M0, the B58B30 M1, and the B58B30 O1. But if you look at the data plate of the engine, which is down here behind the charge pipe, you're not going to see B58B30 M0, you're going to see B58B30 Alpha. So the engine is embossed with B58B30 A. That's the first generation B58 engine, it's the B58B30 A. The B58B30B and the B58B30C are the B58TU engine variants. The B58B30B is the B58B30 O1. That is the B58TU that retains the traditional cylinder head and the traditional turbocharger. The B58B30C is the B58B30 M1, which is the B58TU that further modifies the cylinder head with an integrated exhaust manifold and modifies the exhaust turbocharger. So how do you know which version of the engine you have? Well, obviously the easiest way to check is to go down here. It's very difficult to get the GoPro in there, but down here you're gonna see your engine part number and your engine serial number. But if you wanna check it visually, there are three big clues straight away. If your engine cover is this large engine cover that covers the throttle body assembly with this extra piece here, and it doesn't have carbon fiber elements here on the right side, which is mostly for uh, to make the engine cover look fancy, then it's the B58B30A, or the original generation B58. The next big giveaway is the charge pipe itself. If it's cylindrical like this one, and this union is, this joint is here in the middle as opposed to up here, then it's a B58B30A. The B58TU engines have a more flat charge pipe. I think that is for packaging purposes, making the engine more compact, improving clearances to the fan here. I don't think it has to do with performance at all. The third big giveaway is the silencer here on the intake pipe. If your silencer is rectangular, almost in shape like this one, and it's very prominent and large, then that is the B58B30A. If it's circular in shape, then it's the B58B30B or B58B30C. If you want to know if you have the B58B30B or C, the only way to know that is to have a look at the turbocharger. Have a look at the turbocharger on the left-hand side of the engine, forward looking aft. It's very difficult to film here. But if you look at the turbocharger, you can tell which of the two options you have. If it's the traditional one, like the B58B30A, then you have a B58B30B, you have the higher power engine. And if your turbocharger is the new style, then you have the B58B30C. That's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this first video and see you in the next one. Thank you, Wind, for creating all this background noise now. But anyways... <laughs>